damn him. He wasn't coordinating with the Navy's Emergency Logistics Division. There's a colony nearby that missed a shipment of farming supplies thanks to the chaos caused by these drones. And of course, we need to make the delivery ourselves and they will deal with the rest. And when there is a mission that has red print, make sure you pay attention to what it says. Sometimes it'll say something like, you don't have to kill them. In this case, your ship needs to have a certain amount of space in the cargo hold to be able to fit the farming supplies. Don't leave home without it. All right, some action. Because I like action. And see, I have not made any more progress from in the previous video where I said that I wanted to know more about, you know, which mob, what the mob does so that I could prepare. But then, when I stopped to think about it a little bit, and, and for those of you that aren't familiar, remember I said, well, you may not remember, we when you zone into an area you warp into um, the beacon and the beacon is always a hundred million miles away from what you have to kill you they never warp I have not seen where they warp you right in so you can jump in and you know kill stuff but anyway um, if you I read the mission but it didn't say okay you're gonna be with Infestor Alvi kind of things so, and I guess this is where um, you'd want to go, because there are sites that break down these things, the, the missions and whatnot, and I purposely haven't been there for this, because this is sort of like a little test for me. I would go for like a, a level four, maybe, until I got used to those, but for this, from what I've been told, I've sort of outgrown this. I've, I'm, I'm uh, really more of an advanced level than this. <laughs> I, I say that with laughter because just as I said that, I can feel I'm going to lose a ship on during this, this series. I can just feel it. But anyway, um, I'm not at the level where most people doing this is and that's coming straight out of the tutorials I, to be honest I don't think I could have handled it <laughs> oh my god did you see the video <laughs> I got blown up <laughs> I got blown up for sure okay <coughs> Time to handle business now. <clears throat> Definitely time to handle business. I I can't go cracking and having a giggle fit and then die. I mean that's like getting killed by a bunny in an MMO. I have got to reset my key. What am I doing wrong? It's the same damn key I have, I've always. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> All right, enough of this. Sometimes you just have to laugh when you do something dumb. I, I, I'm probably pressing the wrong key because it's been a minute since I've... Like, a seriously, minutes <laughs> since I've targeted something. And I do have to get these, uh... Uh, this multi-targeting down but anyway back to what I was saying what my concern is is that I'm going to be in a bigger ship than the mission requires and I won't be able to kill the mob because I should be in a smaller ship so but then the flip side is is that if I were to go down to a destroyer I could take more damage too much damage and then lose my ship so And one thing that I learned in um, the Drake, um, when Drake educated me, is that you can't always run away. So, which you shouldn't be able to, because then it would make it a little too easy. 
and I don't remember what my... I have really got to remember what my default... Uh, tar not the default range, the target range is for these. Make it a lot easier to kill. Now, uh, I've switched over to level 1, a lower grade um, drones, because I was told that I would do better with these kind of mobs with the lower level um, drones simply because it's more on their level. Just like I had a hard time hitting a frigate, my drones would have had a hard time hitting a frigate. So I needed frigate killer drones to be able to kill frigates, so to speak. You want to be on the same level, so remember that. And, um... Yeah, this is this is going pretty good. Just this one, it seems. Not bad at all. Then we can drop off this stuff. And then we will have saved the economy. You'd think saving the economy we'd get a little bit more isk than what we're getting. You know, some accommodations, ships. I mean, we're saving an economy, you know? Okay, time to salvage. Be right back. Alright, I gotta drop the supplies off. And yes, I waited to drop the supplies off until I was done salvaging. Priorities, yo. I mean, yes, I'm saving the economy, but the economy can wait, you know, until I finish salvaging. <laughs> oh, man. Now, that would have been... I guess it would have been more realistic if they'd have put a time limit on it. But, yeah, I'm cool with the way that it is. It's only going to take a minute to, to get there. And, of course, you know, this is what usually happens, is that you're far away. And I did upgrade my afterburner. I did do that. So. Yay! We're almost there. Okay. I zoned. I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that was horrible. Okay, it's time to go back. I could have dropped that in there a couple of seconds sooner. Oh well. Alright, time to turn this baby in. I'm still tripping that I... I, I don't know why I was I was I don't know what I was thinking. All right, let's turn this bad boy in. Mission complete. <laughs>